guys, welcome back to our channel. Today is September 21st, aka induction day. Yeah! Won't you take me home? hospital at eight o'clock tonight i'm supposed to be relaxing catching up on sleep but my anxiety and my nerves are just getting the best of me and i can't so what am i gonna do i'm gonna bake and i'm gonna cook dinner because i want to make sure the kids are fed before i leave um my mom is coming over she's gonna stay here with the kids for a few days and me and joseph are gonna be at the hospital because of covid <laughs> you know i'm only allowed one person so yeah, so it's going to be something real quick and easy. I'm going to cook up some um, spaghetti um, with some garlic bread and bake a strawberry cake. <sighs> so they remember mom. I also made sure the refrigerator and the freezer was stocked up. My mom loves to cook, so she'll enjoy doing that and taking care of her grands while I'm in the hospital. I'm hoping for a really quick, easy delivery. My delivery with Amaya was very traumatic, but I'll save that for another um, <laughs> video. So I'm hoping that this induction goes by much better, much smoother. But we shall see. We shall. All right, let me get to cooking, and um, I'll check back in later. Um, I don't know. I'm so nervous. I need to change the sheets on my bed. I just got a new comforter set, but um, I didn't put the new sheets on because I want them to be fresh when I come back home. If that makes sense, I don't know. <sighs> just nervous. <laughs> This is like a studio apartment. My bed. Huh? I smell the snacks. Uh -huh. I smell them. Smell good. What's in here? So this is our laundry bag. It's huge. Wash me. Get 
feel like I've been crying? <laughs> Actually, no, not right now. Okay, so after uh, what, four or five tries, they Actually, have successfully started my IV and taken blood, and my head is swollen. That's number one. That's number two. They took the. They took the one. They took number three off. Yeah. That was number four, four the most painful one. And this is number five. And that's number five. <sighs> so they have inserted the cytotech in my cervix to help soften it, and it's gonna help me start cramping. And they gave me ten milligrams of Ambien so I get some sleep. So you are gonna be sleep before anything happens. Yeah. You. <laughs> <laughs> and they gave me a big old pitcher of water because I can't eat anything and I am starving. Let me show y'all my treat bag since she can't hide nothing. She decided to pack me this whole treat bag and it's actually shaped like a ball because it's been in here so long. <laughs> but everything is compacted in this zip like that. Yep. Twizzlers. Kind bars, I don't know what Jolly Ranchers, um, Rice crispy Treats, some popcorn, you know, something just a just a snack on. Probably gonna be gone by tomorrow morning. Oh another joke. <laughs> Half of it. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, this is my little setup right here. I think the bed goes out. Pull it out like a I had a bad experience last time <laughs> when I pulled one of these jokers out. Oh, that's when we were children? Yes. <laughs> and it was pissy. Somebody peed on it and they didn't clean it. Well, who was that children's hospital? Ahmad's, uh. Surgery? Yeah. Well, look at the adult hospital now. Well, uh, that would explain pee on the couch. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, um, so she's already on and meaning, it, it, yeah, she's about to be out. So, I guess, uh, I'm about to watch TV. And I'm probably up all night watching you. I don't get no sleep. No, Joe, you gotta get some sleep. Plus, her mama gonna be calling me anyway. So, I ain't gonna get no sleep. Other than that, I guess we'll uh, we'll come back later. They say we couldn't video. We can only take still pictures during the procedure and when you know employees are in here. So. You good? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You up or you sleep? Mm -hmm. You sleep? Mm -hmm. You up? Mm -hmm. So it's almost three o'clock. Talk to the vlog. You good? Mm hmm? Mm -hmm. Right, just relax, okay? It's almost 3 o'clock. I'll try to get me some sleep. I'm tired. 
there's just left up out of here. And um, let's refill the IV and gave her some more medicine. So she knocked out. Show y'all how the baby doing. Looks like she done slipped off the monitor. Yep, there she go. And off. She's been on and off the monitor this whole pregnancy. She's almost here. Can't wait. I'm so tired. I want to go home and get my bed. He is cute. survived yeah. it was hard mm -hmm. in the upper the room <laughs> so we went to the doctor this morning I think um, on the third day from the hospital and um, we, f we left the camera at home so we couldn't vlog at the doctor's office. But now we're back at home. And the doctor gave us some good tips because she did not want to sleep last night at all. And um, so she got checked out. She good to go. And now we're just sitting here watching Creed, Creed. 2. Creed 2 in the office slash baby bedroom. Slash movie room. The slash movie room. Slash we just bought this futon and nobody used it because we thought my mother-in-law was going to stay over. I can always but, put it in my room. Trust nah, me. Nah, we're going we gonna to leave it right here. Uh, what y'all going to do with it? Do what we doing right now. Using it as a guest room bed? Yeah, for guess whoever want to come sleep over. I know why she didn't want to sleep here because it was too small. I, I should have told her that she could have uh, pulled it out. I didn't tell her that. I told her it was a couch. She knew it was a full time. Hey, hold on. That's my part right here. Alright, well. Catch y'all later. That's it. Yep. We'll catch y'all later. <laughs>